Hello everybody and welcome back to the Top Vloggers. We are on our way to Cincinnati, Ohio. We have got a lot of things planned for you today, so stay tuned. Don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and notifications to our channel. And don't forget to comment and we'll see you in just a few seconds. There you go. We are in Ohio now. Look at the size of that thing. Wow. That is cute. A giant cougar sits on the top on the roof of Alfred Motors, a car dealership. It was the icon of the Lincoln Mercury Car, car Company and originally sat on the roof. Um, still past Lincoln Mercury, put there in 1968, it was removed in 1988, and now sits down the road from the giant Indian of Cincinnati, another roadside landmark. And we'll see that landmark here in just a minute. i have to turn down this way. Uh, yeah, is one tall Indian. large metal cutout Indian whose arm was once motorized to wave how to travelers. The giant Indian sign on Vine Street looks great. Painted metal just seems more classy than fiberglass, which sits right down the street from the 12 foot tall cougar that we just seen. That's pretty awesome. High and Mighty's Animal Kingdom. This is uh, the entrance to the cemetery. And uh, this is pretty big. This is uh, pretty big. Cemetery that Cat said was for Cincinnati's elite. Cincinnati's elite. So only the best of the best. Oh, there you go. Your wild kingdom's wandering off. Yes, the, there it is. Part of the wild kingdom. Come to me. Come to me. That was a Ace Ventura reference for those who did not get it. And uh, as you can see, they got some nice water. And uh, the, the tombstones are very, are, are, are really big. You know, they're big and they're elaborate and uh, they're what you would expect. Uh, definitely for someone who is uh, in Cincinnati's elite. Charles West, founder of Cincinnati Art Museum. There you go, right there. Charles West 
founder of the Cincinnati Art Museum. Check out that beautiful, beautiful building right there. That thing is old for sure. Says that guy was a bishop. For four years of the Diocese of Ohio. So there you go. That is a very steep hill. I could not imagine having a funeral up there on that hill. I could not imagine. This cemetery is huge. Cemetery is the graveyard for the elite of Cincinnati. In 2013, the family of Kimberly Walker erected two big SpongeBob SquarePants tombstones on her grave. She had been a huge SpongeBob fam fan. The next day, they vanished. The cemetery said they did not fit in the historic cemetery, but on Valentine's Day, 2014, the one-year anniversary of Walker's murder. SpongeBob's were back up, apparently for good. The cemetery apologized, although SpongeBob now no longer faced the road. You may have to pause to read that. Rest in peace, soldier.